Hi everyone. So in my top box, I did select as a priv, privy um, option is to get their super sensitive face balm unscented cleanser. So essentially I got this for like 16 bucks, give or take, right? Um, and you get a hundred milliliters. Um, so I'm going to see how well it works to get everything off my face. So it is for oily, um, oily to normal skin. They have a little, like, I love using Gordon's products because it feeds my skin from the outside in. And it has a little picture of how to use it. So I think that's kind of cute. Like I've never seen a product kind of with like a comic strip, but like maybe sometimes a little bit on some packaging. So it's very like simple white packaging. So it is plant-based. So just kind of talk about like moisturizing your face or like this is a cleanser. So I don't know if they put the right one in. So it's supposed to clarify, brighten, smooth, balance, hypoallergenic. So I was trying to see if it said... There we go. So you want to have a quarter size amount on damp skin. Uh, go with lukewarm water, morning and or night. So just have some water. It's a little colder. So I'm just going to dampen my face. I do like pumps, especially... Like for the shower, just have it in your caddy or sh shelf. So you will want to kind of pump it once or twice before. It's just going in, kind of getting my lather. It's a nice kind of like clean scent. Like a slight like floral, like slightly chemical-y too. But just kind of like almost... And not like a grandma perfume floral, but like actual flower smell. So for ones where they do kind of say um, we're good for taking off oil, I do just like to let it sit there for a moment and try and get things up from where I have issues, kind of like my T-zone. Again, when I'm cleansing with my makeup, I do like to kind of put it on my eyes first and then go around my face. I always find like the under eyelash a hard place to get to because you're kind of trying to keep your eyes closed because some cleansers will burn. I'm just going to wash my face. The smarter thing would be to put the towel underneath me. So because I am kind of just dipping my hands, I am just going to go back in just to make sure I got everything, just to make sure I got everything up. <laughs> oh, so 
I used a pink eyeshadow without any primer underneath. So there's just some staining. And I don't think, <coughs> sorry, I don't think that's the cleanser's fault. <laughs> that it's not really getting that up and out. Because even going in with like a makeup wipe, it is doing nothing. So that's a little, um, I'm not too concerned about staining there because it will just kind of go away. I'll kind of put, a, sorry, um, I will kind of just put like an eye cream on to help get that up. So if you do find kind of staining, don't like over scrub things. Start to use more oils and eventually it'll come up. You just have to correct with your makeup and then just be a smarter person and use an eye primer um, and that. But I do like this cleanser. And again, I like my cleansers to have a pump. It just makes it so much easier, especially when you oil cleanse first and then you can't really see. Just to pump something makes it easier. I do like it's a clean product. I think it did take like the oil out of my skin, like things look a little shiny, but it's like that clean kind of shine feeling. It doesn't feel oily and that. So I am very happy with this cleanser and I like that top box is getting some new and different products. So if you are kind of like, oh, I don't really know about it. I think top box is one to check out again because they are getting better brands. And they're getting like clean products. So that's something awesome to see. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you have a great day. Bye.